I have been working so hard to give you feedback on absolutely everything that you submit to Schoology during this time. So I want to quickly show you how you can see the feedback that I've given you. So the first place you're going to see that feedback um, is a notification. In the top right corner, you'll see a picture of a bell. If I have graded or given you feedback on an assignment, whether that's a discussion, a quiz, or an assignment, a notification will pop up and you can just click on that to see my feedback. You can also just go into the actual assignment. So I'm gonna show you how to do that now. Um, I'm gonna click on this previous week, May 11th through the 15th, and you'll see um, the three assignments from this past week. If I want to look at um, the feedback that I have given you for any of these assignments, what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually click on the assignment. So this student has submitted Activity 1, Definitions and Facts. So I'm going to click there. You'll see that she has submitted the assignment because it says Assignment Submitted here. There are two places that she can go to look at feedback. The first is the rubric. Up in the top right corner it says Grade. And there are these four little boxes and then there's a number out of four. If you click on those four little boxes, you can see the rubric. You'll see the score that you received. So this student um, received a level four. Um, and then you can see what that actually means. The second place that you'll receive feedback is in the comments in the actual um, submission. So what you'll do is you'll click on this assignment submitted here. And what you wrote will pop up. So you'll see here's her paragraph. Um, and then next to it, you'll see the feedback that I have given you. So there are two places in an assignment that you can receive feedback in the rubric. And then by clicking on the actual assignment and looking at the comment that I gave you. If it's a discussion or a quiz, you'll see that feedback um, in a little different way. So I'm going to show you just quickly a discussion. Um, in a discussion, I will just post the feedback um, right below your comment. The rubric will be at the top of the discussion in the top right corner again. So again, you can just click on those four little boxes and you can see the score that you got um, and what that means. So it is so important that you are looking at the feedback that I'm giving you. I'm working really, really hard um, to give you very detailed, intentional feedback um, because I can't be with you to give you that feedback. So I wanna make sure that you are still getting it. So please make sure that you are going back into your previous assignments and that you're looking at um, the feedback that I am giving you, both in the rubric um, as well as my actual comments. Okay, get your language arts work done. Go.